Hi everyone, Farmer Kate here from Cannon Hall Farm. Now you probably saw a few days ago on Sunday's broadcast with Farmer Rob, we had something really exciting happen which is one of our llamas gave birth. Now she gave birth kind of out in the fields and what happened was we thought, you know, the weather was just starting to turn, it wasn't the warmest day her and her baby are going to be best off moving inside so this is where they move to the cattle barn and we're going to go in and check up on her and her youngster because everything didn't go quite to plan in terms of um, mum producing enough milk for this little one so we're going to explain all about that and how we got on in the first few days and where we're at right now so here we are with these two and they both look really well but it didn't all go to plan like I said earlier so what happened when farmer Rob wrapped up that broadcast we were keeping a close eye on her and her baby in particular Roger was keeping a close eye on her and in the kind of few few hours following the birth he wasn't quite convinced that he had filled out as much as he would have liked him to so he kept on looking and looking to make sure he was feeding and it looked like he was trying to feed from mum just there but it wasn't actually able to drink that much so what we kind of thought was she's not coming to a milk just yet so what, what Roger did was give me a ring and we kind of came down for this little one and we were giving a bottle now <laughs> he actually drank the bottle really well which is kind of a sign he was hungry and he was kind of like in need of a feed so he drank about half a bottle that, that night following morning another half bottle so we just kept doing that for a couple of days and then kind of on day three we had like a little bit of a like good news which was I went to feed him and he didn't really want to drink from a bottle which you know is quite good news it might not sound like it but what that meant was he was actually already full because he had been feeding from mum so I made sure I like to check his belly make sure like he was full of her milk and I kept a really close eye on him for the rest of the day. I did try to give him another bottle that evening just to make sure he wasn't going hungry and he didn't want it again. So I kind of gave Roger a ring with the good news and we're hoping she's coming to a milk for a few days later and we haven't needed to top this one up at all. She is on her own at the minute with a, for a little bit of bonding time with her Korea. It is actually a little boy. So because we um, were bottle feeding him, I did kind of get a chance to kind of look just to make sure what we were working with because it is really hard to tell with Kriyas especially when they're newborn and mum is being really protective of them. So she's on a run at the minute and the plan is as the weather is changing right now it's dropping a lot cooler we're going to bring the rest of our llamas in this pen right here with her so our whole herd of llamas are going to be together again. So I hope you've enjoyed kind of meeting um, this little one properly. He is kind of grown a lot even in the last few days, but it just goes to show like how good of a mum she is looking after him and producing all that good quality milk for him. So thank you so much for watching and from me and these two here, we'll see you later. Bye.